happy right now. This is a 10 out of 10. Uh, oh my god. Oh, I love horses. I've never seen big waves like that. This right here, by the way, this little... Here, this is Kento. Kento's having a blast. For him, it's a challenge. For me, it's just not achievable. <laughs> Today is not the best day for my surfing. I'm still having fun, though. You see it on TV. It looks so, so darn cool. Cool people do it, you know, like Hawaiian people do it, people in California, it's so freaking cool. But then you try it yourself and you realize how, <laughs> how unfit you actually are. I don't know, like I'm not naturally gifted. Maybe that's just an excuse, but I'm just not fit. That's my fault, but I'm, a not, I'm not a fit person. I'm very unfit. Surfing we, requires a lot of stamina and willpower and I don't have those things all I have is motivation for fun you know I want to have fun and I love the beach and the water and the ocean and I love how it looks I think it's so cool it's a lot of fun but I'm so bad at it Life is so beautiful when you don't have to work. There's so much to see in Japan. I feel like it's a never ending bucket list. All the different prefectures, all the different coasts, the different climates. It's such a diverse country and I've seen just a teeny tiny bit, but it's always so beautiful. Here comes the best travel buddy in all of Japan and the rest of the world actually. You look so good in your new button up. Thank you. I found it myself. Shut up. I bought this. Last weekend with Luna I bought it. It's a belated birthday present. <laughs>
laugh how I always make it look like you're like 190. I'm 190. You're so tall. Actually, no, you're not tall. <laughs> Wait, say that again. Jane has the ideas and I make those ideas happen. But not all the time. Not all the time. Yeah, you also don't all the time have the ideas. When we're on not trips. Not all the time. When we're on trips. Not all the time. <laughs> not all the time. <laughs> like if I wouldn't say let's go on a trip, I don't think we've, we would have left Tokyo yeah, maybe. for two years. That's true. I think you only feel that you needed a break when you're already on your break. As soon as you're like sitting down and working, you don't seem to understand that sometimes you need to take a break. Yes. Every time that like, we're on a trip, like, oh yeah, this is nice. This is nice. And then me, on the other hand, like I'm at work, I'm like, oh my god, I need a break. You're very different yes. when it comes to that. It's so good. This is the first cafe here in Chiba where they serve soy milk. This is a ginger spice. Ja, also hast du das am Ende doch geholt. Yeah, because they did it with uh, soy milk. So now right here, there's a, like ginger syrup in it. So it's, you should try. Can you try? It's very yummy. Oh. Yeah, I know. Anyways, that's the first one in Chiba where they serve soy milk. And I immediately feel superior to everyone else. Because soy milk is just... Great for the environment. It also just tastes better than regular milk with coffee. I think coffee and soy milk or coffee and oat milk, just coffee and plant milk were always supposed to go together. 